What is going on, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? It's David here with Mac Tutorials 14. In this video, I'm going to show you an amazing jailbreak tweak ignition. Alright guys, so as you guys can see, it does look like that I am on a CarPlay enabled device. But this is not a CarPlay enabled car, this is my iPad. Now believe it or not guys, it is officially possible to get a CarPlay user interface on just your iPad. So this is courtesy of a brand new jailbreak tweak called Ignition. As you guys can see, I went into the music app and basically this is the interface that it looks that it gives. Uh, basically when you play music so you guys can see I'm in the now playing app now and it, you know I'm playing uh, virtual riot energy drink which is actually one of uh, one of the best songs um, and then I skip past to a couple of uh, different songs and stuff like that so anyway um, that is the music app now let's go ahead and check out the maps app now this is um, you know the first couple of releases of this tweak so you know there is definitely going to be some bugs so as you guys can see if I actually go into destinations and go into this you'll see that it'll actually crash back out to the um, ignition uh, interface if you uh, if you actually press start it'll actually crash back out so unfortunately that's a bug and I'm not sure if it's uh, able to be fixed um, you know I, I it's probably able to be fixed and you know it'll probably be fixed within the next couple of versions um, you know the developer will probably push a fix for it but that is the maps app right now so let's go ahead and go into the messages app as you guys can see it brings us it brings us this little Siri uh, pop-up and we can actually go ahead and speak to Siri and basically say send a text to John Smith and it'll, if we have John Smith in our contacts list it'll pull him up and say um, you know, what do you want to say to him? And basically you, you say, you say it to him. Now, uh, basically if you got a text, uh, through your phone, it'll actually show up here. And basically this is what it'll look like. And it'll read the text back to you and basically say, uh, what do you want to do? Do you want to reply? Do you want to, um, cancel? Do you want to not do anything? What do you want to do? So this is probably one of my favorite, uh, you know, one of my favorite features, uh, thus far of ignition, um, uh, and of the CarPlay interface itself, because this is basically just a mirror. Uh, version of you know the CarPlay interface that could be found on CarPlay enabled cars. So as you guys can see, um, you know it has some of my contacts there, and I can go ahead and go into the thread and actually go ahead and compose a new message with Siri. Um, so functions are a little bit limited because it doesn't actually let you um, you know necessarily read you know a lot of your messages in the messages thread. It'll just only allow you to reply to messages and um, compose a message. It doesn't allow you to actually read messages unless you know you get a push notification from someone then it'll actually read the note you know it'll read the uh, text notification to you um, but other than that that's pretty much the extent of it you can't really do anything else but anyway guys that's pretty much it so um, yeah let me go ahead and just back out of this now all right guys so on the left hand side corner of the screen as you guys can see it does display the current time as well as the signal and Wi-Fi bars and on the bottom it does give me a little virtual home button that way we can get back to the CarPlay interface the ignition interface so anyway a lot of people have been asking me how do I get back to the regular iOS home screen basically all you have to do is tap on that ignition uh, little icon as you guys can see and I've went ahead and sped it up and resprung it and as you guys can see now we are back on regular iOS and if I wanted to switch back over to that ignition interface all I would have to do is simply just go ahead and press on that ignition icon that is on my springboard I'm not going to do that now though because it would respring my device all right guys so that's pretty much it for this video this tweak is called ignition it's an awesome car play UI for iOS 8 it's developed by Adam Bell it's available on Cydia in the big boss repo right now absolutely free Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. This is David, signing out. Peace.